Hi, my name is Dorothy Burton and I am in Texas, in Dallas. And I am an anomaly in Texas in that I have been a Republican all my life. All my life. I had been. I voted for every Republican president since Ronald Reagan. I even voted for Donald Trump. I won't vote for Donald Trump. He's been a total disappointment to me. He has proven himself to be a racist, a bigot, a bully, and someone who doesn't care about uh, all Americans. I don't even believe he cares about America. He cares about himself. He cares about his family. He cares about his name and he cares about his fame. He's not a president. He's not a leader. And he's not fit, in my opinion, to lead. And I was a dyed in the wool Republican. And I miss my Republican Party. I miss the party of Lincoln. I miss the party of Reagan. I miss the party of Bush. I miss the party that I grew up in, that I believed in. I believe in the rule of law. I believe in family. I believe in um, doing things uh, the right way for the right reason. I, I believe in personal responsibility. I believe in justice and I believe in righteousness and I believed all of my life that the Republican Party uh, expressed my values and now I don't recognize that party anymore. I'm, I'm like Reagan when he left the Democrat Party. He said, I didn't leave my party, my party left me. The Republican Party left me. But I tell you what I'm going to do. Come November, I'm doing something that I've never, that I never thought I would do. And that is vote for a Democrat president. I do intend to vote for Joe Biden. I have serious philosophical differences with Joe Biden. I have serious philosophical differences with the Democrat Party. I always have. They didn't mirror my values. But now the Republican Party has not only do they not, does it not mirror my values, it has stepped on, stomped on my values. And I will not vote for Donald Trump in 2020 as I did in 2016. I used to joke, I would say, I would vote for a rat before I voted for a Democrat. My, my, my. I I can't believe how far gone the Republican Party is. It's a white nationalist party now. It's a party that bullies people, doesn't respect people, doesn't even respect the rule of law. And it saddens me. It saddens me. But Joe Biden is a decent man. He's an empathetic man. Um, philosophically, I have um, very little in common. But I refuse to stay home. I refuse to waste my vote and write it in someone. I still have hope for the Republican Party, but not with Donald Trump at the head. I voted Republican all my life but I won't be voting for Donald Trump again this November.